instantly think of Kate Moss and the stairs. From her reaction, she knew it was already too late to take back what she'd just said, so to save face, she just continued with her allegations. Amber Heard had courageously mentioned Kate Moss and the reaction she'd expected never came. Instead of Johnny's team looking scared, they looked happy and rejoicing. I hesitate, I don't wait, I just, in my head, instantly think of Kate Moss and the stairs, and I swung at him. Ben even fists pumps the air in victory as if he'd just won the lottery, and I might say he kinda did. Amber has been building this story of how big and bad a monster Johnny is while relying on the fact that no other ex-girlfriend of Johnny was going to counter her claims. No, it was young love, it's a, and we were so innocent and young and so excited about, the, about everything, and everything was so new to us. Since Johnny wasn't allowed to bring up his past relationships unless Amber's team permitted it, Amber had lied about being hit and even sexually abused by Johnny while crying and howling in court knowing that unless she allows it, no exes of Johnny's was going to witness in support of him. I didn't say, like, stop or anything. I just... <sighs> but then regardless of knowing this, she slipped up and mentioned Kate Moss, who is Johnny's ex-girlfriend. Indirectly giving Depp's team the leeway of using both hers and Johnny's past relationships as evidence against her. I just, in my head, instantly think of Kate Moss and the stairs, and I swung at him. Amber mentioning Kate means Kate might now be called in as a witness in support of Johnny. This might not have been the case because she had previously been denied as a witness because she was not relevant in the case. But now thanks to Amber, Kate Moss is very relevant to the case and can come over and support Johnny. She's not the only one who can come in support of Johnny. Vanessa Paradis might also decide to come support her ex-husband and the father of her children as she has never seen him violent for the 14 years the two lived together. Another bad scenario for Amber is if her past relationship is brought into question and the jury discovers that she had a criminal prior where she was charged for being domestically violent to her then ex-girlfriend and even sleeping in prison for a day. As many of you might know by now, Amber Heard has a reported history of domestic violence, including a time when she was arrested for allegedly assaulting her ex-wife Tasia Van Rie at Seattle Tacoma International Airport back in 2009. Her ex-girlfriend might have tried defending Amber claiming that the police in charge was homophobic but that defense went down the drain when it was discovered that the said police was a lesbian activist. So to make matters clear, Amber knew she should not mention Kate. But Amber being Amber decided to still do it and throw herself under the bus. Well, that's it for this video. See you in the next one.